Hey everybody, this is Gail, and I'm going to show you a couple of albums that I made a couple of years ago now, and I got the inspiration from my sister Scrapper, and she has some video tutorials on how to do this album I'm going to show you. I made two of them, one for both of my twin grandbabies. They're six now, and she has a really good tutorial on how to make it. I'm, I just made this box. I'm to keep it in to try to keep it a little more safe but I just think it's adorable this is a little our little princess and um, my little granddaughter loves pink and I got this paper from Michaels on uh, a paper pad I'm, I'm sure you all seen it if you've been to Michaels I can't remember the name of it but it's really cute uh, she loves the glittery dazzle part of it but it opens like this and I got her little name's Chandler and this, I just love this layout of this book. There's little Chandler when she's three. I haven't, I just started putting stuff in it. This is a little flap, but you can put another picture there. And they all, every page has a pullout. And there's Chandler there. So you can put a lot of pictures in this little album. It's just the perfect size. And the next page and there's a couple of little tags in there they're just plain I'm gonna I'm gonna stick little pictures in the back little headshots or something and it's all embellished with just stuff I had around the house and this is a little flap oh these little digital images you see I got from of course Etsy I love Etsy digital images they just are so detailed and I'm gonna put another photo here and there's one of her at Christmas time and it's magnetized, and of course all of them have its pull-out of the paper. Here's the next flap. There she is. I just love, and here's just a couple of little tag pulls. You can pull, put a little, you can either journal on there or put a little picture on both sides, you know. All girl, sugar and spice. I just love this paper. It's so pretty and dainty. More of those images from Etsy. I'm going to put a picture there. Of course, you know, I'm just starting. I, I am way behind on getting pictures in here. I make the books and I never put the pictures in, but I'm going to work on it. That's going to be my new goal next year. For 2017, I'm going to get pictures in these books I'm making. And isn't this just darling? And this is a little book. A little tea party. This is all in that paper pack. Another image from Etsy. I'm going to put a picture of her in there and journal something on the back. She's played with this book a lot, so it's a very durable book. And these are pretty good size uh, tabs to pull out. Isn't this adorable? I love this page. You can put a picture there and a picture there and a journal here. And these all come out. I just think they're adorable. They're so adorable. Another pretty image. A little flap. Put some pictures on. This paper is adorable. I, I want to get some more of it. I want to get it again. I know they always have it. This um, is a little, you just open it up and put some pictures in there. And this is the last page. It's a little pocket. And it, I put a little book in it. And I'm going to put a picture of me and her and made with love. And I'm going to sign it. So that's for Chandler, my granddaughter. And I did the same book. I did the same book for her brother, which is Creed. I'm just going to flip through it for you to see it. There's a little Creed. He loves trains. And this is another little same album, just different color scheme. Look at the little train on the back. It's so adorable. I love it. His name's Creed. Cute little guy. This is just the perfect size book. It's just, it's so durable. They, they've looked at it so many times. I've got this little image off of the internet, and I, I printed it up and put it on there. I just loved what it said. St sticky fingers, dirty face, rugs and pillows out of place, cars and tractors here and there, blocks and boats everywhere, gold and silver have I none, but worth a million is my grandson. And that is so true. He's all boy, a little trade. These are little buttons that I got from Michael's, and I just cut off the little loop that you're supposed to sew it on with and glued them on. More, and all these images from Etsy, digital downloads, and like I said, i got to get busy and put some pictures in here before they get too old. Or me. One of us is going to get too old. 
Here's my little star. Same exact book. It's just uh, different images. Isn't that adorable? Got little ladybug. Um, what are these things? You know what they are. Uh, I can't think of the name of them, but I put them on there. I thought that would be cute. This is, you know, I don't remember where I got this paper. I think I got it from a kit. And I've had it for years, so I have no idea where I got it. Look at these little, yeah, that's what they are, little brads, little brads. And this is just more buttons. See the little, aren't they adorable? They're so cute. Little airplane stickers I got from Michaels. I just love this tab page. Look at the airplane, it's a little sticker, more stickers. I'm just flipping through so you can see. These are just little dots that you glue on. More images. I just love these um, vintage images. I just love this. You can put a big picture. You can put several little ones on there or big ones. It holds a lot of pictures. And another. This is a real colorful page. You know what? This is out of my realm of colors. I usually do vintage, um, pastel-y. Shabby chic, but this was out of my comfort zone, and I just, you know, it's one of my favorite books. So I'll have to do more of them buttons. Aren't they adorable? That you just cut the button part off and you glue them on. And here's another that I love these little pinwheels. These are little brads. Aren't they cute? You just pull them out and put pictures on. I thought this, oh, get in there. I just thought this would be cute because it's they're twins. I just thought these images were adorable. And I thought that was a cute little image. And it folds down like that. And more of the buttons. And this is a book that I'm like on, on hers. I'm going to put a picture of me and him. Made with love by Grandma. And that's the back. Just wanted to share it with you. Go to... My sister Scrapper, and she has a beautiful, a real easy to follow tutorial on this book. And it is, let me see what size it is for you. It's kind of small. I think it's six by six. Uh, well, let me hold it. Yeah, it's a six by six. And it, it and the spine is like a three inches thick. But it is the perfect size. And I just love it. I'm, I'm going to make another one for my new granddaughter that's on the way in March. Thanks for letting me share it with you. Bye.